It's Saturday. That's time for the tabletop role playing game Saturday shout outs. How y'all doing? Thanks for joining me. Eight o'clock in the morning here at Site B on the 26th day of October. It's 57 degrees and sunny. It's Saturday. And on Saturday, we do the Saturday shout out where we try and find brand new YouTube channels, whether they have one subscriber or one million subscribers, and give them a shout out, trying to bring the tabletop role playing game YouTube community a little closer. Now, obviously, for every success, there's a failure. For every failure, there's a success. For every door, there's a window. For every sandwich, there, I don't know. Anyways, uh, so yeah, we're going to shout out some channels again, maybe make some new friends. First channel here is actually a channel I've known about for a while, but for reasons the individual has not been posting, but he's finally been posting, and I'm very excited to shout out Jeff's Games Box. Uh, Jeff and I have been trading uh, comments between each other for a while now, uh, and he's been a very positive person who seems to like my stuff. Lord knows why. Um, so I got to give him a shout out. I've been encouraging him and encouraging him and encouraging him to start posting. And maybe we could even do collabs. But for personal reasons, he put it off. And I completely understand the reasons why he did. Um, but now he has put on his big boy shorts, as they say, and is finally posting. He's only got one video up. But it's a start, and I'm really excited to see where he goes. I fully expect this guy to get more subs than I do, because everybody gets more subs than I do. Anyways, he's got 22 subscribers. One video, let's give him a shout-out and a subscribe. I already subscribed to his channel, but I'm going to subscribe again, just so you can see me. Here I am, subscribing. Yeah, like, share, subscribe. Just gains box link down below, as always. All right. And the second one... Um, as you know, I, I tend to like to shout out YouTube channels that other YouTubers have maybe pooped on a little for whatever reason. So this one came to my attention uh, a few days ago because a, a YouTuber made a very uh, a video about them and said some not nice things about them. And so that interested me in trying to check them out. So this is Desk and Dorks. They've got 2.63 subscribers, so they must be doing something right. They've made 505 videos, and they talk about, well, I don't know, what would it be? Medieval stuff, Dungeons and Dragons, uh, low-level monsters. They just recently did one about Halloween and horror. Uh, cats. Cats seem to be a thing. I don't know why cats are suddenly a thing. I mean, you know, we all love cats, unless you don't. But I've noticed a lot of YouTubers are making, like, uh, how many cats would fit in this dungeon? Cats versus an orc. Um, if you have an 18 strength, you can lift that many cats. I'm not sure why. I don't, it's probably one of those reasons where there's like, there's no actual explanation. It's just sort of collectively, unconsciously, we all started to just compare things to cats. It's probably part of the cat's plan to take over the world. Anyway, so. Yeah, you know, uh, general smorgasbord of D&D &D and D&D &D adjacent type videos. He talks about game design. He talks about um, different styles of gaming, um, currency, reviews, role playing. Looks like he's got a really nice setup where they use a lot of, you know, the screens and they string things together. Very well done. Why is my phone ringing at? From Astigadito, California? That's not even a real place. Hello? Hello? Oh, hi. All right. Do you have the address? Yes. Space number 65. Okay, thank you. Bye. Oh, it wasn't a phony. It was something getting delivered that I ordered. What was I talking about? Oh, this great channel. So yeah, so somebody said some not nice things about this guy. 
So I decided to give them a chance. And so far, I am liking everyone, they, everything I see. And I, you know, my, 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 my birth, my, my New Year's goal, my birthday goal, because even this year I've said some not nice things about people, is to try and be nicer. I'm even trying to find nice things to say about like Genie D. Um, you know, so I'm really trying to be nicer. And I'm really trying to say more positive things about gamers. So and it, it really pisses me off when there's these guys out there who just build their whole channel around pooping on people, you know, not even offering correct, you know, constructive criticism, just basically saying, oh, well, this guy said some things and I completely disagree with these things. And I'm now going to spend half an hour telling you why I disagree with these things, because my way of playing goblins with sticks is better than that person's way of goblins with sticks. So they're an idiot and I'm not. And if that's what you need to do to make your channel work, well, I understand because, you know, that's a thing that works. But I, I don't respect you. Uh, I don't respect the part of myself that used to do that. But at least I'm trying to be better about it. I want to, you know. Um, so anyways, deaths and dorks, we're going to give you a like, share, and subscribe because you deserve it. Uh, we've got our third one today. We don't have a lot today. Um, slow week. Uh, we've got uh, Thomas Fitch. This is another one that was set to me. And speaking about people who make references to things to other things, he's got this whole running thing about tomatoes, which is absolutely hilarious. There's my delivery. <laughs> this is Thomas Fitch. He's got 3.1K subs. He's got six videos. How does he get 3.1K subscribers with only six videos? What the fuck is this doing right that I'm not doing right? So, yeah, he looks funny. He's smart. He does things with tomatoes. Um, he's got a good channel. I don't know how, you know, he's got to be something else to have gotten this many subs with only six videos. So let's give him a like, share, and subscribe. And I'm about the doors about to uh, get knocked on. I have a feeling. Yep. I hear somebody coming up the walkway. Hold on. Sorry about that. It's getting deliveries, um, medicine stuff. You don't need to know about that. Anyway, what are we talking about? All right, we're talking about another one. This is the DM's Lair. Hi, he has got 168 K subscribers, 826 videos. I'm surprised I haven't subscribed to him yet. He's got tons of videos, mostly D&D stuff. He's pretty big. He just did a co-op with Professor Dungeon Master. You know, Professor Dungeon Master is one of the people I really respect in the hobby, in the YouTube hobby. Um, and just just a plethora of videos about D&D. &D. But, you know, he's not 100% shill because he does also call out the bad stuff. And he strings together his videos really well. He's always got something good to say. If you're looking for design, to how to be... A better desire he, he just game wise channel wise everything wise i don't know i just can't say enough good things about him probably because other people have said bad things about him probably i've said bad things about him and uh, it looks like there's something going off i might need to buy myself a new computer pretty soon <laughs> um yeah there's something weird going on with my computer right now um so this is dm's lair and uh now normally this would be the part where i shout out a VTuber, but I'm having some computer problems. Um, so hold on. Where is she? I had a, well, this isn't a new one. This is one who'd taken a break for a while and now she's back. And, you know, I talk about my favorite VTubers and the VTubers that really, oh, or whatever. And um, this one is Hakura. Be done. That's Gavin Newsom signing the strongest rent control law. Okay. What did Mott say about the cover? Did she like it? So Hakura, as you know, is my Oshi. She is my 
person I would like the most to hang out with because she's me. She's a female version of me. Uh, she's a goofball. She's very dense. Uh, she's asexual and autistic and just a lovely um, ray of sunshine. And when she's not doing video games and being goofy, she talks about what it's like to go through life and becoming a VTuber and as somebody who has autism. Plus, she's Canadian. So that just means she's that much nicer. So in my, uh, my spectrum of VTubers I discovered, obviously, Iron Mouse was the very first VTuber I discovered. And from Iron Mouse, I discovered Hakura and Zen and Melody. Though, actually, I kind of knew about Melody because of her other job. And then I discovered this one and just like, wow, yeah. Um, she's me. <laughs> she's a female me. You know, she's somebody I could hang out with and just have amazingly conversations about dense stupid things and realize you know it just it would just be pure goofiness so yeah i mean not that i'm ever going to meet her but she, yeah you're my oshi and i love you hakura purely platonically well i mean all the visu vtubers i shout out are all people i think are really really cool and they're the ones that inspired me to do this and a lot of them are the people that i know it's weird because most people just think they're anime girls um but a lot of them are the reason why i do this you know the original shout out my uh iron mouse that gave me the original idea to do this sorry no i know there's other people who think that i'm copying them for doing shout outs to other channels but you know those are the people that say bad things about other channels and i'm trying to say nice things um iron mouse was the first and the others have just also just filled that wow here are people who don't have to be nice, don't have to be opening, don't have to be friendly, you know, because there's plenty of VTubers and YouTubers that don't, but they, these guys just seem to go out of their way to be nice and find other channels and try and build them up. And it, almost every week I'm see, I see a new person that they're hanging out with and trying to help. And I think that's awesome. You know, when I switch over to um, Twitch next year, if I could ever figure it out, um, I, selfishly, that's one of the reasons why I'm doing it is because I want to meet these people. I want to talk to them. I want to tell them what they mean to me. And I want them to, you know, help me be better at doing this YouTuber thing. Uh, it's my job. So definitely Hakura. Shout out to Hakura. She is awesome. And I absolutely love her. And thank you for being cool. And thank you for each and every one of you for this uh, weird Saturday uh, with all the phone ringing and the doors being knocked on. I knew I was getting a delivery, but I was expecting it like when things are normally delivered, like a 10. <laughs> uh, anyways, it's a medical doctor thing. You don't need to worry about it. You know, just blah, blah, blah. The old GGMS falling apart. So thanks for your patience. If you appreciate me doing this every weekend, let me know. If you never want to see me do this again, ever again, let me know. The links to all the channels I shouted out are in the description down below. Ah. Uh, I have a feeling before the day is over, you're going to see me again because we're probably going to have more Wizards of the Coast news. I need to follow up on the weird thing going on with Commander um, because apparently threats were involved. We'll talk about that in a different video. Have a great day. See ya! Stay gleam, so it seems nothing rings. Raise this channel, riot loud.